Every child has a right to a childhood like this. In addition to the commitment of parents, states and education system, 25 years after the adoption of the Convention on the Rights of the Child, the corporate sector can contribute to improving the state of children. There is a very interesting historical connection between UNICEF and the corporate sector, which dates back to the last century, when UNICEF invested in development of the dairy industry, in the education of future workers and in development of the shoemaking industry. Today some of these companies are UNICEF partners. Such companies are now joined by leading domestic and foreign business. If you ask me, I would introduce UNICEF classes in school. Why? Because I believe UNICEF engaged partners, companies, people who are aware, have the right mindset, are correct in their behavior to our children and can convey the right social, cultural and ethical messages to children. Projects that increase the safety of children are in fact investments in future business leaders. Advocating for children's rights translates into responsibility for the state, society, future jobs, the survival of a country, and I think that companies that do not see this and have no place in a competitive market. Respect for children's rights is a logical business policy. The inclusion of child rights in the business strategies and corporate culture on the one hand brings companies a better reputation, but on the other hand creates the future workforce and future consumers. Respect for children's rights by the business sector creates healthy and strong communities, as well as sustainable and inclusive markets, all of which are essential for development of the private sector and for the prosperity of society as a whole.